hey, if you're a person who follows alcohol launches, you know, just like me, you will know that Heineken has recently launched the Heineken Silver. And today, we're going to see how it compares against the Heineken Original. Hey there, SG Alcohol Guy here, making use of my Wines and Spirits certification, which also includes a study on beers, to give you honest reviews on the alcohols that I am tasting. And as mentioned, there was a launch by Heineken uh, regarding this Heineken Silver. So I want to see how it compares against the Heineken Original. So Heineken Silver debuted in Singapore uh, with a massive party on the 15th of June 2022 and they didn't invite me. But it's okay, I'm gonna give an honest review as well. So let's compare with the prices first. You can clearly tell which is the original and which is the silver. One's green, one's, well, silver. And also, I got a six pack of this at around 19 Singapore dollars. So that makes it around 320 Singapore dollars per can. Whereas for the silver, um, the current retail price is around 21 Singapore dollars for a six pack. So that makes it roughly 350 Singapore dollars per can. But because this is like the promotional period, uh, there are many places offering the first can at 50 cents. So that's the price that I bought it for. And let's start comparing the cents. While I let the cans breathe a little bit, I just want to tell you what I get at those prices. For the Heineken Original, this comes in a 330 ml can with 5% alcohol content. Whereas the Heineken Silver is also a 330 ml can, as you can see, but it comes with a 4% alcohol content. Now it promises to be even smoother than the Heineken original. So let's see. Again, I'm going to pour it in such a way that the beer comes out, uh, the foam is in the glass, so that's not even going to be in my stock. Now holding them up side by side, I'm going to tell you that there is no noticeable color difference. They both look identical. So let's see. In terms of scent, the Heineken original comes across as having a little bit more body, uh, whereas the Heineken Silver comes across as being lighter. So maybe that 1% difference in alcohol content gives off that difference in aroma. But now, taste test. Heineken Original first. And Heineken Silver. Okay, so flavor-wise, they have a common theme, which is you know a little bit more sweet. It's a slightly sweeter lager, and, and both have that characteristic, it's a little bit sweet. But the difference is that the Heineken original, I can taste a hint of malt, uh, a hint of that maltiness at the back, plus it's a bit rough, you know, coming down my throat. The Heineken silver, I can't taste that maltiness. Plus, I don't have that roughness, you know, coming down my throat. So it's definitely a lot smoother as a beer compared to the Heineken original. So what I feel is that if you like a sweeter beer, uh, go for the Heineken's, definitely. Now, if you want something that has a bit of a rougher taste or, or you, know, you like that malty flavor, yeah, the, the Heineken original is definitely for you. But if you just want a beer that goes down smoothly and is still sweet, then yeah, the Heineken Silver is going to be a good option. Personally, I think I'm going to go for the Heineken Original because it is a little bit too sweet for me, so I like that rougher ending, you know, to just balance that out. But it's all up to you. Hey, thanks for watching up to this point. I hope you enjoyed this review. Uh, if you can, you know, do help me click on the like button. Uh, if you haven't subscribed to the channel already, why haven't you? Please help me click on the subscribe button as well as the notifications so that you can find out when more videos are being released. More importantly, drop me some comments. Let me know if you've tried the Heineken Silver, what's your take? And as always, happy drinking!
Thank you.